guys, it's Kendra. Today I wanted to do a video dedicated to the products that I buy over and over again on Vitacost. So if you guys have been watching me for some time and then you know that I buy pretty much everything that I possibly can online on Vitacost because it's basically like you get products that you would get at Whole Foods and Sprouts but for way less expensive and it's just more convenient for me. I can order online and I get it. Sometimes I get it the next day which I don't even understand how it's possible. At our old apartment I placed an order in the morning and I got it that night. So usually you'll get it within a like two days. That's I usually get it within two days. So I just placed an order so I have a lot of things to show you but I also just kind of walked through our house and looked at things that I typically buy over and over. These are all home products and food items. So there's food things, um, like some cleaning things, things I get all the time. Uh, what else do we have? A lot of food things I actually got this time. So I thought these would be some good things for you guys to add to your cart if you haven't heard of some of these products before, or if you haven't heard of Vitacost, then I will put a link down below. You guys can check it out. You will become obsessed. They also have a lot of um, like beauty products and stuff like that. So if you are looking to try more natural, you know, like shower gel, shampoos, face wash, moisturizers, like everything you can think of, they have that there as well. I have done a lot of videos on that sort of thing, so I wanted to stay with just like home products and food things for now. Um, but I will link some videos down below that I have like more favorites and that sort of thing. Okay, so I am going to start with food things. So first up, I have a cereal that I love so much. I honestly don't eat cereal very often. Typically in the morning, I will have a granola bar right when I wake up with water and coffee. And then I'll have breakfast like an hour later. Um, and I usually have eggs. I love eggs. I have eggs like every single day. Um, eggs and avocado. Or I'll have oatmeal or yogurt and granola. But when I do have cereal, this is my absolute favorite. And all these products are going to be gluten free too. So this is by the company One Degree Organic Foods. It's called the Veganic, so it's vegan and organic, sprouted brown rice cacao crisps. And they taste just like like a better cocoa crisp. <laughs> you guys used to eat this when you were little. They're so good. They're just a little bit chocolatey. I love this with almond milk. It's like a treat in the morning. Next I have some crackers that I get all the time. I think these are in every single order that I place. They are by the company Vans, and Vans has a lot of good gluten-free foods. These are their fire roasted veggie uh, baked crackers. And these are really good with hummus. I love hummus. I eat hummus almost every day. And these are just my favorite kind out of all their crackers. They have like an everything one, I think just like a sea salt. They also have some cheddar crisp, like cheddar crackers that are really good too. But these are just delicious. They're actually really good on their own too. Next up is Quest Bars. Now I get these mainly for Andrew because he loves these like he eats them all the time. But these are the best protein bars that I've tried. Like if you want a lot of protein, these have 21 grams of protein. If these did not have the chocolate chips, there's like giant chocolate chunks in here, then I wouldn't like it because it just tastes like a typical like protein bar. But the chocolate makes it okay. So I, again, these are another thing that I get in almost every single order. These are a good thing to grab if you need something to fill you up, but you don't have time to eat. Like if I have to drive somewhere, like if I'm going to LA, I like to take one of these in my purse just in case I get hungry during the drive or something like that. Next up I have a baking product. This is the wheat-free, gluten-free, dairy-free baking flour by the company Bob's Red Mill. I get most of my baking supplies are from Bob's Red Mill. I get all of my baking supplies online and this is the one-to-one -one baking flour. So it's um, some, some gluten-free flours don't like they're not exactly the same as regular flour. This one I find is just as good. It's it was so hard to find a good gluten-free flour. I think they have another one too that I like as well. It's just like their gluten-free um, all-purpose flour, I think. So this is really good for cookies, brownies, cakes, whatever you're making that you're baking. I don't really use flour all that often just for when I'm baking like cookies or something like that. So this is what I usually get. Next up are some chips. These are my... Oh, these are my weakness. They're so, so good. They're by the company Boulder Canyon. I love Boulder Canyon's chips. These are the sea salt and cracked pepper, which are my favorite. I could eat all of these in one sitting. They are so addicting. I also have the olive oil ones right now. 
they're good, but not as good as, I like these because they're a little bit more flavorful with pepper and, oh, they're just so delicious. So, these I like to buy multiples at a time because I go through them so quickly. Um, I'm trying to think of some other chips that I get. I honestly usually get these. I sometimes will get Pirate's Booty. Um, there's another company that I'm trying to think of what it's called. Um, a gluten-free chip company. And I usually get, they have like the lime kind. I'll try to link it down below if I can think of it. Next up I have some granola bars. These are, the company is called Nature's Path. And they are their dark chocolate chip chewy granola bars. I like these because if you like the typical like chewy bars, I used to eat those all the time like in high school. But if you want something that's like nice and chewy, you will love these. There's a lot of gluten-free bars that just aren't chewy enough. They're kind of hard. And I was looking for just something that's soft. And these are them. The other ones that I love are Kind Bars. They're my favorite. The ones I like the most, though, I used to get the Kind Bars, like the nut but Kind Bars. And I, I've gotten sick of them because I was getting them all the time. And they're good. But when you're eating them every single day, you get sick of them. So now I get the... They're just the granola bars, kind granola bars, and they come with, on Vitacost, they come with three boxes, and they're so inexpensive. And then in each box, you get five. So these last me a long time. These ones are the peanut butter dark chocolate. I also really like the, I think they're the pumpkin seed and sea salt. Those are really good, too. They're in the purple packaging. So these are non-GMO. They have oats, millet, quinoa, amaranth, and buckwheat. They're really good. Next up I have some crackers that I recently discovered and I kind of wish I didn't discover them because they're so good. So they're by the company Earth Balance and they're cheddar squares. They're vegan, zero trans fat, zero trans fat, and non-GMO. They taste just like Cheez-Its. If you like Cheez-Its, you need to get these. I don't even like Cheez-Its. That's why it's weird. Like, I don't even like Cheez-Its. I don't like goldfish at all. I don't like goldfish at all. I don't, they like, it's stuck in my teeth. I don't know. But these are just delicious. If you ever want, especially if you guys are gluten free, you probably know the feeling. Sometimes you just need something that is like satisfying because, um, you know, when you're not eating bread and you're not eating those types of products, you just want something to snack on that's like, that is gluten, like crackers. Sometimes I just miss crackers. So I got these just randomly one time in one of my orders and now I'm just so in love with them. I crave them. If I don't have them, I want them so bad. They're so good. Next up, I have some milks that I get, which is weird to say that you get milk online. I'm one of those weird people and I order my milk online. So this is the Silk Almond Milk Unsweetened Original. I like to use almond milk in my cereal, which I was saying. And then I also get coconut milk. This is a so delicious dairy-free coconut milk unsweetened. I like this for my coffee sometimes or in, it's really good in um, oatmeal actually, it kind of like gives it a nice sweetness to it, but coconut milk is super good. Also with like uh, chai tea, if you could ever get the chai tea concentrate, I also get that. I got that, I placed it in my order, but then they were out of stock because of Black Friday, they were like, um, they didn't have everything. So usually I get like the chai concentrate though, and I'll do half coconut milk and half of the chai, and it's just like a nice treat in the middle of the day. And then this I recently discovered, and Andrew loves this. So, is this kind of cute? It's the So Delicious Dairy Free Coconut Milk Creamer, barista style. I'm wondering if this is the same one I got last time. This looks different. I don't know if they changed the packaging or if I got a different one. I'm not sure. But, anyways, I'm sure this one will be just as good. Tastes delicious. It has just a really nice, rich, like, sweet taste to it. It's not overly heavy. I used to use half and half for my coffee and that's too heavy for me now. That's why I just prefer milk or like a coconut milk or this. Almond milk's a little too, I don't know if it's bitter, but it just changes the way my coffee tastes and I like to taste my coffee. So these are usually what I use to sweeten up my coffee, just a little bit. Okay, two more food things and then I'll move on to a couple of household products. So this is actually new to me, but I usually buy my um, almond butter on Vitacost, but this one I haven't tried yet, so I don't know how this one tastes, but it looks really nice to me. I don't know, it looks kind of like cute, the packaging. So it is Barney Butter, and it's their bare almond butter, no added salt or sugar, and it's smooth, peanut-free, gluten-free, and I usually get, I'm trying to think, the Maranatha one, um, but this one I decided to give it a shot. I think it was on sale too, so let me know if you tried that. 
And then this, oh my goodness, if you guys haven't tried this company before, it's the Immaculate Company. They have amazing cookies. I got the sugar-free, not sugar-free, um, sugar cookies last time, and they were so good. And then these ones are the chocolate chip cookie mix. So good. My friend made these one time, and I couldn't even tell that they were gluten-free. Okay, let's talk about some household products. So the first, let me talk about these. I usually get my hand soaps from there. My favorite is the Mrs. Meyer Clean Day in lavender. Oh my goodness. So lavender scent is so good. It doesn't even smell like the lavender. To me, it smells like like a sweet, like a sweet. I mean, it does, okay, it smells like lavender, but it's not super floral or herbally, which I typically like. But it just smells like I don't even know. Trust me, it's good. You'll like it. And then the other one that I just got because I was looking for like holiday stuff on there, and they had a new holiday collection from Deep Steep. I use Deep Steep's um, body scrub. It's so good. They have a lot of good good body products. So this is the Peppermint Vanilla Argan Oil Hand Wash. And I also got this Snowflake one too, and that smells like a, kind of like a lemon cookie scent. But this one I keep in our kitchen, I just think it looks really pretty and festive. It's gluten-free, non-GMO, and it smells really nice. Like peppermint, <laughs> just like a sweet peppermint. So if you guys can get your hands on some of these, holiday things before they're gone, I would definitely recommend it. Just type in, I think I typed in Deep Steep, no, I just typed in Holiday, and then the Deep Steep products came up, but if you type in Deep Steep Holiday, I'm sure they've come up on um, the page really quick, so there's that. Next up, I have a laundry detergent that I get all the time. This is by the company Caldrea. It's a sea salt and a rolly scent, and it smells so nice and fresh. Mmm, it smells like the beach, it smells like vacation, I love it so much, it doesn't irritate my skin, it's a really, really good laundry detergent. I also am trying a new one, I don't want to tell you guys yet because I haven't tried it yet, um, but it's a new company that I want to try out, their laundry detergent, and it's like a really good pure line, so stay tuned for that. Okay, this, for all time of this, is a tea, I love getting my tea on Vitacost, this is by the company Traditional Medicinals. This is the Everyday Detox in Lemon. I haven't tried this yet, but I have tried the Skin Detox, which is so good. It's like a sweet tea. It's really delicious. I usually get the Traditional Medicinals or the Yogi Teas. Next is some cleaner. So I love the Honest Company. They have really good products. They're Most of them are on Vitacost. This is the Glass and Window Cleaner, but I have their All Purpose Cleaner. I have their Bathroom Cleaner and a few other things. They smell really nice. This one is the free and clear, so it doesn't have a scent, but the bathroom cleaner, I think, is peppermint, and then the all-purpose cleaner has, like, a different... They're really nice, so if you guys want some new household cleaners, definitely check out The Honest Company. They're really good, non-toxic, no harsh fumes, and pH balance. I also get our dish soap from Vitacost. Just basically all of our cleaning supplies are from there. This is the J.R. Watkins Aloe and Green Tea Dish Soap. I haven't tried this yet. Did I try it? I might have had a... No, I have a soap in this. But I usually... What do I usually get? I have the one by EO. I also have one by... Oh, the Mrs. Myers is what I usually get. But I figured I would try this. I think this was on sale too. And the last, which is so exciting, is trash bags. I love these trash bags. These are by 7th Generation. They're the Tall Kitchen Drawstring Bags. You get 20. Make sure you're getting the 20 count. The 30 count don't have the drawstring ties. I made the mistake of getting those one time and it was a pain. So they just look like typical trash bags. And they're also made of 55% repurposed plastic, which is really nice. So love those. So those are all the products that I love to get on a regular basis. There's a lot of other things too that I get, but this video would be very, very long. So let me know if you guys like these types of videos and I can do them more often for you guys. There's just so many different brands and products to try. It can be a little bit overwhelming. So I hope this helped you out a little bit in sorting through all the different brands and seeing things that I really love. I hope you all have a great rest of your day. Thank you so, so much for watching. Give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed and make sure to subscribe to see all of my future videos and I will see you guys soon. Bye. I am going to take my NARS Radiant Creamy Concealer and apply that on the inner part of my eyes and then a little bit of a V.